As Americans live longer and the baby boomer generation gets closer to retirement, the problem of how a growing amount of seniors will get around is beginning to impact transportation planning. While some seniors are still able to drive their own cars, many have had to give up their driver's licenses and must now depend on public transportation and other methods of getting around. We spoke with a few seniors at Norton Young Love Senior Center in Calamesa to hear how they have tried to get around this growing issue. Everybody's tried to help me out because I'm making all these adjustments, which, which I'm not, I'm having, I'm having difficulty making these adjustments because I've always been kind of independent. You know, I'll do things myself. I call the senior center over in Yucaipa, and they got a they got a, um, a program called Senior Companions. So they they got a lady that they sent to my place. She comes once a week, and she can give me four hours a week. She said you can do what you want. You can go to the grocery store. You can go to the park and take a walk. You know, whatever you want to do in these four hours. You know. In order to get transportation, we we call people. And they are kind, they come and pick us up, but it's embarrassing because the fact is that I, I, don't, I can't get a driver's license because the fact that I'm, I'm, I'm not completely under control with my right leg. And so we're just at the, uh, people have been very kind to us, but it's uh, embarrassing to, to act, ask all the time. 